Hello, my name is Tim. I am. Uh, I live in Atlanta, Georgia. I'm an ex-Republican. Uh, I was a Reagan Republican until Donald Trump won the election, and then uh, I realized that this is no longer my politics. Uh, and, and no, I didn't vote for Trump. I, I didn't vote for anybody, actually. Uh, I felt that, unfortunately, the alternative wasn't any better. But uh, I would have, uh, hindsight being 2020, I would definitely vote over Hillary over Donald J. Trump. Uh, I have a 35-year history with Donald Trump. Uh, just a lot of things he used to say back in the 80s. Uh, I voted for Ronald Reagan, my first president. And I voted Republican uh, historically throughout my entire life. Um, but now going forward, I plan on voting blue all the way down. I don't care if I've never heard the names or the people or anything. Uh, the GOP, as far as I'm concerned, has sold their souls to the devil. It's time for change, people. It's time to wake up. This, this man is not in our best interest. He is in his best interest. And I pray to God Almighty that he does lose. And, and, and as well as the GOP senators that have emboldened this man, uh, I personally hope that if Biden does win, I do plan on voting for Biden. Um, that if he does win, he does nominate an AG that goes in there and investigates Barr, goes after McConnell, goes after Graham, goes after Johnson, goes after Kennedy, goes after all of them. Um, somebody somewhere is getting paid something under the table or something here because this is just insane. And my biggest fear is that we're on the precipice of, of our own civil war in this country and other countries are looking at us and laughing at us. Uh, you know why the uh, other countries in the Middle East aren't attacking us anymore? Because we're attacking ourselves. We're, we're killing ourselves. So please, if you really care for this country, you don't care for just yourself, especially the evangelicals who really cracked me up. Me as a, a self-proclaimed Christian, I'm not the most hardened Christian in the world, but for God's sakes, wake up. If you only want this man in office because of the judges he selects or uh, the, uh, Roe versus Wade, I mean, Really? You're going to sit here and back a, a known racist, bigot, liar? Really? So for God's sakes, wake up, people. Make our country right again before it's too late. And, and, and a lot of regret will happen if something's not done sooner than later. Thank you.